Now the first experiment I like to call cool chemical reactions. And here, we're going to get some Play-Doh. Now I made this Play-Doh. You can get recipes easily off the internet, but you could pick up some from um, a shop quite easily. Now, when we're using things like vinegar, ask the children, your, your son, daughter, to put on some safety glasses. If you don't have safety glasses, just put on some sunglasses. Now we want 100 mils of vinegar. Then we're going to pour in some soap. Now this doesn't take part in the reaction, um, but it just helps to give an added bit of foam. We also want to make it lava colour, so if you can get some red food colouring, even better. And get them to pour it in. In goes the vinegar, washing liquid and food colouring. You want to get them to add two to three spoonfuls of baking soda. In it goes one, two and three. And let's see what happens. So, you can see we've got an erupting volcano there. You could ask them what would happen if you put in some more vinegar. Ask them if you put some more baking soda in now, what would happen? Next experiment, still with vinegar and baking soda. Now ask them to get a bottle and you want about 150 ml, so it's maybe about three quarters of a cup. You don't want it to go over half of the bottle. Now, the next job is to get two spoonfuls of this baking soda into the balloon. You can just pour it in, but it's a little bit messy. I'm going to use this funnel. We're going to put this over the rim of the bottle. And you want to ask them now, what do you think is going to happen when we drop the baking soda in? Is there a chemical reaction taking place? 